Hi there, good evening sports fans, we're back again with a few pickups. Uh, I know it's been a while, a couple of uh, weeks or maybe a couple of days, I don't know, I can't really remember. I um, haven't been too well of late, but hey, I'm back with a few pickups. A um, few things that I picked up last weekend, a few things the weekend before, a few bits from Japan and a few bits from the UK. So, let's start. Um, first of all, this pickup was uh, a charity shop. So I went in this charity shop and had a little look around and I found some uh, box Super Nintendo games complete with manuals. Reasonable price, so I picked them up. Reasonably fresh considering it's 20 odd years old, but uh, I wasn't going to leave that there for 3 99 Next one is in even better condition, they went in an extra pound or two for that, so I picked it up anyway. I was a big fan of that back in the day, International Superstar Soccer. Manuals in there, everything. So, a couple of nice pickups, I was pleased with them. I had a little um, ride up to Lincoln, up to Gotham Games. Ended up picking a few things up out of there. And these are what I managed to pick up. Gods on the Mega Drive, that's a pretty good game. You, you more or less know anything by the Bitmap Brothers is decent, so I picked that up. I don't think that was too bad, I think that was about seven quid. So we'll have that. Uh, another one I picked up while I was up there, some one of you fuckers posted a video about Sensible Soccer, I ended up watching it and then ended up buying the damn game. Nice uh, copy of Sensi there, so I'll pick that up. That will go nicely on the retro. I'll give that a try soon. Uh, another one I've been looking around at for a while. I'm a sucker for puzzle games and things like that, so there you go, Marble Madness. That was all I got from there. Next one, ah, right, some Japanese stuff that came the other day. We have a Neo Geo CD title first. There we go, Ninja Commando. That's a pretty good game, that is, to be honest with you. Been looking for that one for a while at the right price. Glad to get that. Next one's another shooter on the PC Engine CD Gate of Thunder. That's a good shooter, that one is. Not the cheapest uh, game in the world either, but uh, I've got it in the collection. I've got a real spanker coming soon, a Japanese one. Real dirt cheap price. Factory sealed as well. Uh, the next couple of games I've got are ones that I picked up from a shop at the weekend when I went out with Chris in um, Stafford. Retro Game World, I think it was called. Uh, there we go. You can see it in the background on the screen. Wonder Boy 3, Monsters Lair. That was not bad for twelve ninety nine. I was quite pleased with that. Uh, the next one is another copy of Pang on the PC Engine. So I've got two copies of that now. I wasn't going to leave that there for twelve quid because it's it's easily worth double that, maybe even more. So I picked that up. Um, I was watching an eBay auction for um, a few Sega Saturn bits, and this came up. Virtua Cop with the gun, and it's never even been used. The game's still factory sealed inside it, so quite pleased to add that to the collection because it's my first um, gun that I've got. Not really had much experience with gun games since the crappy light gun that came out with the Amstrad, and I think I had um, maybe I did or maybe I didn't. Maybe I had Duck Hunt on the NES. Can't remember it was so long ago. Well, I'm glad to add that to the collection anyway. It looks nice in the big box, doesn't it? So, yeah, that was another one. Just put that out of the way. And then I thought I'd have a little dabble with a new system. So um, I'm going to buy some games, but I've got a system to play them on. I'm looking for a Dreamcast at the moment. So uh, being a big fan of the Rock Band Kiss. That was one of my first pickups. Kiss Psycho Circus, which I believe is a shooter. We will give that a go. 
and I was a big fan of things like Railroad Tycoon and that kind of thing so I picked up Railroad Tycoon 2 now I don't know why I bought this one I was on the late night one of the nights and looking through the games and I, I used to like football management games so I thought I'd give one a go I ended up buying this for £7.50 it's called GK and apparently it's you know, quite difficult to get hold of it's, you know, it's not too cheap so I was glad to get that so we'll give that a try when I eventually get a Dreamcast and this one, next one was a, a gift from my buddy Pete Pete Armour it is Quake 3 Arena and it's minty fresh absolutely minty fresh this game is I don't think it's even ever been used to be honest with you so that came and of course I won Pete's competition so I had a PS2 turn up as well so I was quite pleased with that my little boy loves it um, yeah and you know I've got a few little pickups there I've got a few other bits and pieces on the water now that should come shortly so looking forward to getting those but I had a thought the other day I work to earn money to buy games but working I don't have the time to play half these games it's crazy really isn't it so I'm going to try and make some more time up to actually play some of these games you know just a thought, a random thought that came into my head before I made the video. So there you go. Um, the rest of my pickups are all vinyl, so I think I might make a separate vinyl pickups video. Because I know a lot of you guys, vinyl doesn't get you uh, aroused, should we say? But uh, yeah. there you go. It's been fun, guys. So yeah, we have nothing else to pick up. So I shall be back soon with some more videos. Take it easy.